Hey everyone, and welcome back to The Sims 4. Now, since the last episode, I have been reading crap tons of your comments. Now, just quickly, let me find out what day it is. It is Thursday, so Jay Huntington doesn't have work. Danny does in nine hours, and we were trying to get him up to that extra... Well, I, he can't get promoted anymore, but we want to try and make him even higher. Um... What about her? She's got work in 18 minutes. She hasn't done her friendly skill. How's her mood? She needs the toilet. Okay, use it. Use it. Use the toilet quickly. Because you start working a minute. I have a lot to tell you guys. A crap ton of stuff. Um, okay, so she's finished the toilet. She's now going to go off to work with the school kids. Okay, so if we make her work hard. Now, one thing um, I do want to show you guys is um, I've actually tried installing a school mod which allows you to go to school with the kids. And it seems to be working. However, I think there's a little bug where when they go to school, it normally asks you if you want to go to school with them. Um, and to fix the little bug, you have to like fiddle around with something. But I'm kind of glad that it didn't ask me to go to school because I didn't really want... Oh, what the hell's going on? I didn't really want to go to school with them right now anyway because I've got a crap ton of stuff to tell you. Um, so let's get Danny ready whilst I explain. Well, because he just kind of just kind of stood there. Potential cheater. It isn't easy earning top grades, as you guys probably know. Uh, I felt the same when I was at school. And Jackie is feeling the pressure now. It doesn't help that one of the girls he keeps sitting close to glances her way with her sweet, innocent eyes. Is she trying to be friendly? Or just copy off Jackie? What to do? I think... Should we confront her? I think we should confront her. She might like him. Or it could go terribly wrong, but I think we should confront her because I think it'll be funny. And uh, let's see what happened. Even if the girl is trying to copy, she'll never admit it. When Jackie accuses her of cheating, those sweet, innocent eyes fill with tears. Now everyone thinks Jack is mean. Ah, oh, man. Well, that's not good. By the way, I have actually started... This guy, okay, I went on the Sims community and I just found he was like one of the most top downloaded people. <laughs> yeah, okay, there's no need to laugh about it, bro. Okay, yeah, we get it. You downloaded a lot. Um, but what I did was I built him a house because I was, I, I was reading your comments, okay? And, and look at this house. I built it, okay? It's terrible, I know. Um, maybe I'll show it to you guys later, but I put a tree down. I put some bushes down. I made, I made it so it wasn't just square. So I made it like come out diagonal. You guys are like, he's such a noob. Like diagonal walls. I did that in Sims 2. Well, I did it in Sims 1, okay? Um, but I just don't play The Sims that much. But I'm getting more and more used to it. I was reading your comments, okay? Um, and they make me so happy, okay? Let, let, me, ex let me explain because I want to make sure that I'm doing something on screen as well. Otherwise, you guys are going to... You guys are going to be like, Danny, this is a vlog. You're just talking to us and you're not actually playing anything. Okay, so I'm going to serve brunch for me and Jay Huntington. Okay, because I have work in five hours and this bastard doesn't have work for two hours. And I shouldn't have probably sworn then, so I'm going to try and stop swearing. Um, But anyway, okay. Last recording session, I recorded crap tons of stuff. And I keep saying crap an awful lot, I've just realised. I recorded a lot of stuff, um, and I've been uploading it daily. Yesterday, which for you will probably be three days ago, I actually missed a day, and that was purely because I was busy, I was playing games with friends, and I was on Skype with friends and stuff. There's not really much happening, and I don't want to super speed it up because I need enough time to talk to you guys, so I'm sorry about that. Um, so I was busy yesterday, and, and I thought... And I was, I started to edit an episode because I've been doing one a day and I thought I've got to keep doing one a day. And I, and I was editing it and I thought, well, I could just pick a beginning and end and just 
edit it, edit it out. However, this episode, I don't feel comfortable with it having interesting stuff the whole way through. So I wanted to watch watch it through, and it's about 35 minutes, and cut out some boring bits, perhaps. So, I didn't release it. I thought, you know what, I haven't got the time to release this right now. I want to just watch it through, make sure that something happens in it, something interesting happens in it. Because the one before that is me explaining what I wanted to do with the house and stuff. And, you know, I, I, f I feel obliged to try and make The Sims more interesting. Because you guys are professional Sim players. And I want to make you guys proud, okay? I want to make you guys proud. I want to make something that you enjoy watching. Something that you get inspiration from. And something that I get inspiration from, from you guys commenting. And I've written down loads of notes from your comments. Uh, okay, so we need him... Wait, why am I doing Jay Huntington? I don't care about him. Um, okay, so we need some fun. So if we go watch our crappy television. So I was reading your comments, and you guys know so much about The Sims. Like, it is crazy. You guys know so much about The Sims. But instead of being mean, like saying, Danny, you don't know how to... I'm going to show you something. I'm going to show you something. Okay, watch this. Why is it not working? <laughs> Why is it? Oh, there it is. There we go. <laughs> Holy crap. Okay, someone commented. Well, actually, a few people commented. And I'm sorry that I didn't write down your names. If you push shift and the little square bracket, you can change the size of things. Okay, we've got to make that really small again because that is far too big. I, I have no idea why you're able to do that. Um, because they were like, Danny, you need a bigger television. Yeah, guys, that is not the kind of big television I want. However, when we get a flat screen, maybe we can make it a little bigger. Um, so I've, I've been reading your stuff, okay? And you guys know all the tips and tricks. You're proper pros. You're awesome builders. And this is where it gets good, because I, I want you guys to create some stuff to go in the map. And I'll explain a little bit more soon once daddy goes off to work i'll explain it um but instead of you guys being mean and saying danny you're awful at this game i'm not watching this anymore people are commenting such nice things like danny i'm loving your series i um this is awesome i love watching this let's put this away um and you're you're being kind okay you're just kind people and i don't think i've seen one really horrible <laughs> comment that has made me go <laughs> seriously they've all kind of put a smile on my face because you guys are just enjoy what the frick scavenge for parts apparently you can pick stuff up and drag it as well you see i'm let danny stop telling people to clean stuff just drag it to the sink i now know how to play the sims guys <laughs> um Seriously, I read all your comments, okay? So let's just get him to, uh... In fact, can we actually drag this to the bin? Okay, we can't drag it in that bin. Can we drag it... Apparently, I think it only works for plates. I have actually dra dragged them into the sink to test it, and it and it works. Seriously. Seriously works. Uh, works. So, it, wait... C yeah, can you leave, please? Someone actually said we should fire her because we have so many people living in the house. We don't really need her. So, I think... And we've only got $131. Holy crap. We might actually fire her soon, I think. Um, so, yeah, it really warmed my heart. So, I've written down everything you guys wanted me to do. The main comment that I have seen tons of... Danny, you need more beds. And... I'm gonna I'm gonna hold my hands up. I have to admit I have neglected the bed situation. We have six people and only three beds. Now we we do have a problem there. So I'm thinking after Dan is finished work. In fact, I'm just gonna speed this up because holy crap, we've been going on slow mode and you guys are just watching it. Probably going. Should Catherine invite over classmate Jared? Wait. Is that a guy's name? Catherine. You should be dating a guy called Jared at your age. Is it a guy? Wait. The guy just walks straight. 
up to our door. Wait a minute, he looks funky. What's he? Has he got a hat on? Oh no, it's an afro. Okay, that looks cool. I thought he was wearing like some cool chic blue hat. Because his hair looks blue. Is his hair blue? No, it's black. Okay. It look Okay. She invites him over and then goes to bed. What a what a nice friend. Well, he's having fun with the bear. And considering we don't have that many beds, they uh they, they need to sleep. Okay, so what we're gonna do is when Danny finishes work, we're going to fix the bed situation, okay? Um So yeah. Let's uh, send him off to work and make him work hard. Okay, we want him to work hard because we want that bar to go up. So I'm just going to speed this up whilst he's at work. The second main comment was, Danny, I think it's time you and Zoe got married. So that is what we're going to do. We're going to prepare for a wedding. Now, we can either do it fairly soon, like a small low-key wedding. I'm not actually sure how you do it. I guess you just propose to her and then you're engaged and then you do the wedding later, which would be great because we can do the wedding when the house is finished. Um, so that would be that would be fantastic. The next one was change their clothes. Now, apparently, if you grab someone, so we're going to change Jackie Patel, okay? We're going... And if you go up to the mirror... Change appearance. Okay, here we go. This was a main comment as well. A lot of you guys wanted me to change his appearance. Well, people's appearance. Because I kept saying, Mike, what, what the frick is up with their clothes? Kind of thing. And you guys are like yelling in the comments going, Just Change the clothes! Change the clothes! In a nice yell. You weren't like going, Danny, I'm going to kill you if you don't change their clothes. Okay, right. How do we do this? Edit relationships. Okay, we don't want it. We don't. We don't need these tips. Thank you very much, because I'm, I'm a pro. I have people helping me. Okay, so this is cool. This is his. Don't you have to like select what? Uh, I guess. I guess we we'll just change his clothes. Okay, what should we have him wear? I think we should have him pretty cool looking, not nerdy kind of active looking we're, we're gonna i don't know we could be quite basic you know just a regular looking t-shirt maybe a red one that looks maybe because jackie chan j j does kind of wear a lot of white shirts with jeans so if we wait did he have pink jeans and pink shoes okay well we're making him look more Okay, we're gonna have those colored jeans. That's the kind of thing that Jackie Chan would wear. And we based him off of Jackie Chan. So, I, I've got a whole much, like, hey, I'm just doing what Jackie Chan wears, okay? Okay, well, already that looks a ton better. Can we actually change his hair? Oh my God, we can actually change his hair. That's awesome. I guess you can just go to like the barber shop and, okay, this looks cool, right? Yeah. I like Jackie Chan doesn't have his hair like that, but that looks pretty cool, so we're gonna keep it like that. And his face I don't know, his face looks okay. Do you think it looks okay? I've done a good job on the back of his haircut, which is wonderful. Oh, okay, here we go. So this is his everyday. This is his formal wear. Well, that actually looks pretty cool. I've got to say, check out those glasses. We get we. Okay, we'll keep that one because I think that's pretty cool. His active one, we're definitely changing this jacket. Who the frick wears that? I think that's why you guys were yelling at me because you were like, you can actually change that jacket. Because I, I said, why would they wear a jacket whilst doing? freaking sport i said it i did and what you can't get vests in athletic yeah damn right we'll uh, we'll do this okay we want him okay should we have a nice blue one you, you can see this is my concentration face right here um okay let's have a red one a bit colorful and it goes with the red stripes as well but we're about to change those because we're gonna have shorts 
Okay, what colour shorts should we have, guys? Black. And I'm sorry if I'm not picking the ones you want. Obviously, um... In a minute, I'm going to ask you guys to actually build your own stuff for us to put into the world to be our neighbours. So you guys can uh, start thinking about that right now. Um, okay, so this is his sleep stuff. Okay, so he needs gym jams. That's right, I call him Jimmy Jams. You got a problem with that? You got a problem? Take it up with my lawyer. Um, and then we're just going to give... We'll give him one of these shirts. Not a pink one. Okay, we'll go with the football one, just because it's a little bit colourful, a little bit wonderful, a little bit spectacular. Should we give him, like, some some glasses or something? Okay, he's not going to wear socks, and he's not going to wear bright... I, I guess it's because i got this. Should we give him a bracelet? You won't be able to see it, though, so shoes. We'll give him these little tiny weird-ass... Shoes. They look. They look quite cool, though. I, li I like those shoes. Okay, party. This is how. It, what? What are these shoes? Seriously. Can you zoom down to see these? What? What the hell are those? Okay. So he's going to a party. He's gonna wear his standard shoes. Um, jacket. I don't like this jacket. It's like a, a grandpa's cardigan. Now, if you wear cardigans in real life. I'm not judging you, okay? Okay. This is his party stuff. I know he's only a child, but he's a, he's mentally very mature. He likes leather jackets. Okay. I've never worn a leather jacket. I'm not cool enough. Okay. That is looking very uh, Grease. I don't know if you've ever seen the movie Grease. I actually haven't. But it's looking like that. Okay, we'll, we'll have, like, some grey jeans. Because it's a little bit more unique than the regular blue jeans. So, okay. And then, and I'm not going to edit all the characters in this episode. We'll just do him for now. And then a little bit later on, we can go through them individually and do them all. Because for some reason, like, Danny has changed his work clothes. Like, three times, I think. Every time he gets promoted, it freaking changes. Little git. Um... Okay, I think that's pretty cool. Or should we go with the red? We'll go with the red. That's, that seems cool. Okay, how do we save this shiz? There we go. So we've changed his hair. We've changed his outfits. It might not be 100% suitable and you guys not, might not 100% agree with it. But I think we've done a good job. Drag them in. Put in your family. And you guys will be in the series with me. And so, a couple of people commented this and I thought, what a great freaking idea.